We made it to Birmingham. We're making a quick stop to Target before we get to our hotel. My mom wants to get some packing stuff. And I low-key want to buy like a cheap little portable speaker just to have when we are actually in Anguilla. Right after this, we went straight to the hotel because we had a 5 a.m. flight out of Birmingham, so I didn't vlog for the rest of the night. Alright guys, we just made it to the airport. I have on the same shirt as yesterday, but I forgot to bring a sweater. Um, we're gonna go to Comfort Unless this is Concourse. We in the airport, John. About to board. To our destination, we are staying at Tranquility Beach. It's just been a long day of traveling, like that was a lot. Finally, after 10 hours of traveling, we made it, and I was so excited to finally be here in some air conditioning. Our grandpa actually met us at the airport, helped us get to our place, and we ended up going to his house for the rest of the day. But to finally be here after eight years was really nice. And this was our beautiful view. And there's my dad. <laughs> All right guys, today was my first official day here in Anguilla and I realized yesterday when we arrived that I didn't give you a full tour of this beautiful place we're staying at. So real quick, I'm gonna show you guys. Bruh, it's so nice here. So first we have the front door. She's cute. Right in here is the first room. Look at these mirrors, y'all. Out this window, you can see the beach. We got all our suitcases in here and stuff, but this is the first room. Y'all, this bathroom, kind of insane. Look at this tub. Like, I probably won't use this tub, but that's insane. Then we got this shower. It's one of those little rainfall showers. Over here, this is my little outfit of the day, by the way. There's some mirrors, this little sink area. Out this window, you can see more of the island, and the beach is that way. Cute little toilet. Oh, and this place came with a washer and dryer, which is pretty cool. This way. These such pretty pictures all throughout the place. Over here is kind of the living area. There's a couch. This is a pull-out bed. This is where me and my sister are sleeping. Right here, we have a TV. Cute, cute. And then this is the beautiful kitchen. Y'all, this kitchen is so cute, bruh. Like, come on. Come on. So this is a little kitchen area, comes fully equipped with everything we need. And then of course the best part is out here, the balcony and the jacuzzi. Like period, how cute is this? It's a jacuzzi and the beach of course out here. Hey guys, so we've actually been in Angola now for, I don't even know, maybe this is day three. Right now I'm looking at this beautiful blue ocean, like, hello guys, hello, it's so pretty. So I'm really excited, I'm about to get ready for the day. This is the most chillest vacation I've ever been on. When I tell y'all, you just wake up and chill all day, get at the beach maybe, visit family. Today we're actually picking up my little cousin Joselle, she's just gonna spend the day with us. Joselle was actually in one of my last videos, I bought her a bunch of school supplies and I told you guys that she actually lives in Anguilla. She came back to her home, I think a day after we got here. So we're basically just gonna hang out with Joselle. So we're about to get ready for the day. And yeah, I'm gonna just take y'all with me, obviously. But right now I'm looking out at the water and it's so blue. It's just so pretty. But braids has got to be the easiest vacation hairstyle. Like, I don't have to do my hair at all. Bring up in this bun, take a shower. And when I'm ready to go, I take it off the bun. All right. Of course, y'all, I still brought my skincare. Y'all thought I wasn't gonna bring my... Mm. 
Mm -mm. But what I like about Bioma, they made these little travel sizes, which is so convenient. I don't have to bring my whole entire thing. Ooh. No, these lights could come on. Get ready with me. This is the most vacation vacation I've ever had. We're not doing nothing but vacation. I have been taking like two showers, sometimes three a day because, well, just cause it's like so humid here. Obviously we're on an island, but I just be feeling a little sticky. Like I have to. This is my whole skincare routine right here, y'all. How cute it is. The hydrating serum, I'm gonna let that sit on my face and kind of dry a little bit. Then I'll moisturize. And while I let that dry, I'm gonna go ahead and brush my teeth. No stinky breath over here. Stinky, stinky, stinky. I'm all clean. I smell good. My face is washed. I brush my teeth. Now let's go pick an outfit. My outfit of the day is just this Aritzia t-shirt and these jeans, shorts, and probably these shoes right here, honestly. But right now I got my house slippers on. Anyways, I'm ready to go. I'm just gonna wait on the rest of my family to be ready to go. And we're gonna go pick up Joselli and do some fun things. Probably hit the beach. Guys, it's so freaking pretty here. I don't wanna leave, ever. You can't make me. And because we're like out of the country, my sister got this, which is like a portable Wi-Fi thing. So even though we have no like cell service, we got Wi-Fi everywhere we go. I don't think I'll ever travel out the country without that. Cause we have come to Anguilla before and like everywhere we went, I was just, I had no service. <laughs> That's our little Jeep that we're driving in. It's so cute. We headed out and we'll probably go to the beach shack cause we are hungry and I wanna go back to the beach shack cause it was so good. I had fish tacos last time and it was good. Original, original. Dun, da, da. Yes I do, yes I do. Building, there are people in here that can't cut. We made it to the other side. Joselli! Hi. Where are we at? This is my mom's house. She's passed away. I grew up in a house that was there, but it's no longer there. And this is my mom's house that she built. The bakery was downstairs. All right, guys, I got a new cameraman. Her name's Joselli. Period. We decided to go back to the beach shack. The beach shack is my ultimate favorite place ever on the island, okay? Mark my words. If you go there, you have to you have to go to the beach shack, okay? I don't know what it is they doing with them chicken tenders, but there you go. So we went back to the beach shack and we took Joselle. You been to the beach shack? What's your favorite thing to get? Cookies. Cookies? No, real food. Burgers. Burgers. Time for the beach shack. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to eat at Blanchard's Beach Shack because we ate there already and it was so good. I had fish tacos. What'd you have? Wings? I had wings. And what did mommy have? Curry chicken salad? I don't know. But today I'm trying something new. Joselle said I should try the cookies. I'm hungry. I need food food. So we'll have to see. I ordered. What did I order? I ordered a big bowl with mahi and yeah, and a water. And this is our buzzer. It's August 1st. Wake up! It's the first of a month. Today, we're walking the beach. We're walking all the way down here. Good morning, I'm about to eat breakfast. Today, we're having the Village Bakehouse for breakfast. I got a egg and cheese croissant. I love croissants. Mm. It has 
it's been honestly so hard to film here because when i tell y'all we've been doing nothing but chilling on the beach and eating good food like i'm gonna take you guys along with me the whole day today we literally be waking up with no plan and whatever happens happens but that's literally it kicks how bruh it doesn't get better than this like do y'all see this oh my gosh let's see the difference oh my gosh look how much wider that is i'm gonna show them the difference all right guys look at the difference this footage is the zv1 mark ii and this footage is the mark one look at the difference you see all this oh my gosh you guys this is my first time filming on this new camera this is my sony zv1 mark ii i think it really is wider this angle is so wide <gasps> i need to turn off this soft skin glow effect because my skin ain't this clear there goes my daddy it's just a So what's up to the vlog, man? What's up, vlog? We about to go to the beach shack for like the fifth time. I think that's our favorite place to eat. Also, it's right up the road from where we're staying, but they have the best food. So we gotta be there again. Beach shack, beach shack. We just left the beach shack. It was 10 out of 10 as it's been every single day we've had it. Now we're just gonna drive around the island. We, you know, sightseeing. We get to see a lot of Hello. nice views. Oh. Saw a gift shop on our little drive. So we're gonna stop in and see what they, oh, a kitty! <laughs> 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 Alright, we're gonna Alright, we just picked up some balloons for my Auntie Wendy because it's her birthday today and we're gonna drop them off and they're nice and pretty. Thank you. So it's currently breakfast time. We are at the Village Bakehouse. I'm about to get breakfast here and they only have breakfast so we had to wake up early and come. We all really love the vibe at this place. My sister ended up getting this blueberry muffin. I got this spinach quiche. My mom ended up getting a salmon quiche and a coffee. And my dad got this amazing looking omelet and French toast. So we just chilled here, had breakfast. We're at Oishi Delicious Asian Kitchen. We are actually now at my dad's cousin's food spot. It's like a sushi place, so I'm really excited because y'all know I love sushi. And like I said, this is my dad's cousin's spot. You want the orange stuff? Yeah. 
I just tried so many different kinds of sushi. I know you guys saw that sushi bowl. There was so much to choose from and I tried all of them and it was so good. But I'm full right now, stuffed, so. So far I'm enjoying my time in Anguilla, but I'm not gonna lie guys, I am getting homesick. I don't do well being away from home for this long. Um, so I'm trying to thug it out. I'm trying to thug it out these last two days. Never again book me a vacation for eight plus days, y'all. I can't do it. I think six days is my limit. I think I miss my bed after day six. I'm trying to make the most of it. I'm literally in paradise right now. There's no place like Anguilla in the entire world. I can tell you that right now. They have the best beaches in the world. So like, I'm gonna stop tripping and um, enjoy my time, live in the present moment because I don't know why I'm tripping about how I have to go to school on Monday, all this other stuff. It's not Monday today, but it's Thursday. <laughs> what if I died before school and I was tripping about school? Exactly. I gotta go back inside. It's hot. Nobody gave me the car keys to the Jeep. But I just wanted to tell you guys how good that food was real quick. Yeah. And he's eating it right now. Came back home to the house just for a real quick second because I had an interview with USA Today that I had to be on Wi-Fi to be able to join through the Zoom and everything. So while I'm here in Anguilla, I'm able to try one of Anguilla's local fruit, which is kinnips. In other places, they're known as ginnips, but in Anguilla, they're called kinnips. Anyways, they're really good. This was my first time trying it on this trip and they're so delicious. But you have to be careful because they can stain your clothes really bad. So this what it looks like. It kind of looks like a, a mini lime, but it doesn't taste like a lime. It tastes more like a mango. You gotta break it like this, and then you gotta open it. Suck on this meat, but don't eat the seed. And then you just put the seed in the trash. It has like a jelly consistency, I mean texture. So comment down below if you've ever had a kinnip or a ginnip or whatever you call them. All right guys, we made it to Anguilla Sand and Salt. So we're about to go inside and check it out. Too. Me and my sister both got these necklaces with sand from Shoal Bay inside of it So we will be taking a piece of Anguilla home with us and now we're at the gift box Which is another souvenir place, but my dad don't know how to drive a Jeep. So we're trying to park I love that one Here. We stopped at home to change into our bathing suits. I have a bathing suit on underneath here. We are doing the kayak tour tonight, and it's a night kayak tour with boats that glow. So I'm pretty excited. And a, no, I'm not nervous. I'm not scared. I'm not gonna fall out or nothing. <laughs> but we're just gonna head over to my cousin's um, booth because he cooks really good food. Oh, he did today. Stop the music. Nice yeah, yeah. And she don't want to get copyright. The name Tree Bar and Grill. Coming straight from Diddy, my grandmother. She inspired me to cook along with my mom. So that's what I do. That's local curry chicken and rice. Mighty rice with two beans. That's how we have it. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. This is where my dad grew up. This is where he was born. This is his little neighborhood. We in my dad's hood, you feel me? This is my beach where I learned to swim. back from our kayak tour like two hours ago i'm actually hungry again so i'm gonna have an instant noodle that we got from the grocery store so i'm just boiling some water and now probably the last thing i eat 
for the day. So we just stopped back at the villa because we had to change our clothes and get into, you know, nice dressier clothes because we're eating at a nice place today. We're eating at somewhere called D. Richards. It's a steakhouse. It's supposed to be really, really good. So we all changed our clothes and we have cute clothes on now. This is my outfit. So yeah, we're gonna go eat at this place. I haven't eaten anything, so yes, I did. So yeah, let's go to D. Richards. Today's our last day. We're leaving in a few minutes to head to the airport. <sighs> so I'm gonna get my last good look at this beautiful view. Oh, it's such a nice day today too. And of course my camera's fogging. So pretty. This was definitely one of the best trips we've ever taken as a family. And I think after this trip, everybody's down to come back. Um, like once a year type beat. That's gonna be it for this week in my life for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope everyone out there someday visits Anguilla because it's really freaking beautiful here. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys give this video a big thumbs up, hit that post notification bell, and hit that subscribe button. I love you guys so much, and I will see you in the next one.